A shooting on I-4 in Volusia County has Sheriff Mike Chitwood fired up. He's not happy both suspects are now out of jail on bond, even though the gunfire hit a family's car. News 6's Molly Reed picks up the story. Right lane, high speed. So these guys are gun toters, they're thugs. Uh, how, how nobody else gets killed because what we believe was it was a running gun battle on I-4. Volusia County Sheriff Mike Titwood says a family with parents and children was driving on I-4 when they found themselves in the middle of it. They see a car that's driving erratically and it's, it's out in the emergency lane and they see a hand come out the window and start firing. Uh, a round strikes the minivan that they're in. The family catching it all on their own dash camera quickly calling police and giving them this picture and information to find them. The suspect's Camry was found in Deltona. The sheriff Sheriff's helicopter followed the car going over 100 miles per hour at times, speeding through traffic until the driver lost control and crashed. Well, we have spin out. Good Lord was looking out for everybody in this because to think of I-4 on a Saturday afternoon in the middle of bike week, how much traffic was out there. Deputies arrested the driver Kobe Hunter and his passenger Dion Brown. Both faced numerous charges, including aggravated assault and aggravated fleeing. Both going into the woods from the rear of the car. The sheriff says Hunter was arrested in 2018 in connection to a Sanford homicide case, but the murder charge was reduced. Brown has a prior conviction of aggravated assault with a firearm. Despite this, both men were able to bond out of jail over the weekend. Because they both bonded out, they have not been in court yet. Their first court date has not been set yet. In Daytona Beach, Volusia County, I'm Molly Reed getting results, News 6.